Hello, 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 Kevin here, and welcome to the start of a new series, Because Reasons. This is NetHack, specifically uh, nethack.alt.org, which is a place where they host the NetHack games. You can just log in and play it there rather than installing it to your own machine. This is a fancy, state-of-the-art, super crazy game that uh, I've been meaning to play for the better part of my entire lifetime, and I figured what better time to start than now. So this is kind of their login screen for NetHack 3.6.0, who's just updated, actually, at the end of 2015. They released this uh, latest version. So that's, you know, it's still, it's still getting patches. That's good. I'm going to go ahead and hit play. I've not done a lot of research into this game. Uh, this is a, kind of a seminal game for many reasons. But you see copyright 1985 to 2015 by Stichting Mathematisch Centrum and M. Stevenson. Um, so yes, okay, so we have this prompt, shall I pick the characters, race, role, gender, and alignment for it? No, I would like to pick that myself, please. Uh, no, okay, so I've got the name, I've already, I've signed up, I've set up an account, so I'm named Cheers Kevin, and I have to choose a role. Uh, archaeologist, barbarian, caveman, healer, knight, tourist, wizard. I'm gonna be a wizard. I like to play wizards. Wizards are fun. Should be okay. I got to pick a race, human, elf, gnome, orc, or random. Oh, I don't know. I don't, let's be a gnome. Gnomes are cool, and let's be male just for verisimilitude. And is this okay? Oh, my alignment is neutral apparently. All right, sure. I'm, I'm totally fine being neutral, like Switzerland. Or yes. Okay. So we have this prompt here. It is written in the Book of Thoth. After the creation, the cruel god Moloch rebelled against the authority of Marduk the creator. Moloch stole from Marduk the most powerful of all the artifacts of the gods, the amulet of Yendor, and he hid it in the dark cavities of Genom, the underworld, where he now lurks and bides his time. Your god Thoth seeks to possess the amulet and with it to gain deserved ascendance over the other gods. You, a newly trained evoker, have been heralded from birth as the instrument of Thoth. You are destined to recover your amulet for your deity or die in the attempt. Your hour of bravery, your hour of destiny rather, has come for the sake of us all. Go bravely with Thoth. Hello, cheers Kevin. Welcome to NetHack. You are a neutral male gnomish wizard. Okay. And so, okay, so this is the amazing graphics that are that is NetHack, because this is a game from 1985, and you could play it on your regular good old computer. So you see, at the bottom of the screen, we've got something that is reminiscent from Dungeons & Dragons or other kind of gaming things that have written, ripped stuff off from Dungeons & Dragons. We've got strength and dexterity. Ooh, I have some, I have some crazy dexterity. For especially, because I'm a, a wizard supposed to have? And constitution, intelligence, wisdom, charisma. I have a lot of intelligence. That's good for wizards, I think. And the idea is that we walk around here in this dungeon until something happens. Um, we've got dungeon level one at the bottom. We've got the amount of money that I have, which is none. I have 11 hit points out of 11. I have eight power out of eight. My armor class is nine. I have discovered that uh, if you're familiar with role-playing games, generally the armor class is something that you want to be high. Not, it didn't used to be. You used to want it to be low, and that's true here as well. And then we've got experience and turns. So, and it seems to have cut off my name. So I'm Cheers Kevy the Evoker, apparently. Okay, so there are a lot of key commands. You can see this is, this is me. I'm walking around. Oh, there's a, there's, there's a rogue D. Oh, it's a fox. The kitten picks up a gold piece. The kitten bites the fox. Kitten is being busy. Fox misses the kitten. Okay, uh, let's attack it. I kill the fox. The kitten eats the fox. Okay, so I am this little at sign, and I'm wandering around by pressing the numpad. Oh, the kitten dropped a gold piece. Thank you, kitten. Ooh, there are things here. A gold piece and a brass wand. Cool. Let's pick those up. I can pick those up. I can hit A and B to toggle. Yes, those things. Uh, kitten is continuing to pick. I'm going to pick up all the gold pieces. And look at that. I got I got money. Now. Okay, kittens. Okay, so the kitten is is a pet. That's cool. Um, let's let's look at inventory. All right, so I've got all this inventory. I've got a quarter staff. Okay, cool. And uh, scrolls and stuff. Do I want to equip that wand though? I don't. See, this is the thing. I don't know very much about this game. I just have spent enough time to sort of understand some of the gameplay. 
and okay. So, okay, the kitten is in the way. So we're walking around, we're trying to explore, we're trying to find lower dungeon levels and eventually recover this amulet thing that they were talking about in the early, in that, in that uh, description stuff. So I'm wandering around. You can see that my turn count is tracking at the bottom. We're gonna go ahead and, ooh, I killed a newt. Hooray for me. I have no experience. I didn't get any experience from that, though. That seems hardly fair. So, yes, this is the... Oh, there's a downstairs. But let's explore the rest of this this level first. Okay. So you can... Yes, so these are, these are doors and walls, and these are the corridors. I can walk through here. Okay, the door is locked. Open it. Okay, so I'm hitting O, and then in that direction. No, I'm going to kick in that direction, then. Aha, I kick it and it crashes open. Hooray for me. All right. Walk that. Ooh, I hear some noises in the distance and I hear some noises. Very ominous. Ooh, I hear some, I see a, a dude over there. Whoa, what? Okay. I There's what where, where did he Oh, okay. I killed it. All right. Oh, I see a lichen corpse. All right, let's take it. We'll pick it up. And we'll go this way. Okay, okay, there's no, is there nothing over here? So one of the things that I discovered when I started trying to play this, which I, I've really only sunk maybe a, a half hour to an hour, is uh, you run into these dead ends where you pretty much can't do anything, but there's a key combination. Uh, there's, there's a search key, which is S, which sometimes it's a good idea to type because there are sometimes hidden doorways and passages and stuff that you may miss or that, that are just not displayed, and then you realize what's going on. What is this? What is this? Uh, what do I want to look at? I want to look at something on the map. Place a cursor to the unknown object. It's a fountain. Okay, so that's what that key, the, that character means. Ooh, I can get more info. Rest, this little fountain runs. Thus for I, it never stays. For the look of summer... Okay. Enough. Whoa. No, no. Now I want to play again. Ooh. There's an OD. OD. I killed the fox. What about the O? I killed the go- Ooh, it's a goblin. Ooh, an iron skull cap and a red gem. Cool. Ooh, a jackal. A jackal. Jackal? Jackal. It looks like a jackal. Jackal? Okay. What happened to my what, my pet, though? Where did, where did that go? Is it following me, maybe? Ooh. I, okay. I ran into something. I gotta pay more attention. I'm doing this. What's going on? Where did my pet go? If my if I lost my pet already, I'm gonna be very very sad. I I mean I guess maybe it got captured by zombies. Pet, where are you? Did you end up down here? Okay, seriously, what what is what, what what's going on? I have no idea. What's going on? Where are you? Um, did we explore all of this? I can't remember. Oh, well, clearly we have. Oh, ooh, there's some stuff. Okay, let's go this way. Uh, all right. 40 gold pieces. Oh my gosh, I'm rich. I'm rich. We're totally going to win now. All right. Um, yes, okay. What, what, what? I, I'm not seeing my pet, which is making me sad. Uh, door resists. Door opens. Huzzah. If I've, if I've lost my pet already, that's probably not... Ooh, there's an exclamation point. A rogue exclamation point. Let's pick it up. Oh, it's a puce potion. Whoa, whoa. A thing happened. What was that thing? Whoa. I feel a wrenching sensation. Okay. Uh, what is that thing? There's something on the map. What is that? Oh, it's a trap. It's a teleportation trap. Well, that's kind of cool. All right, let's teleport again. Oh, I escape it. Okay, well, let's untrap it. Untrap. I cannot disable the trap. Well, fine then. You disable it. Whoa, more stuff. Did did my pet die? Did, I think I think my pet may have died. All right, I don't know what's going on. All right, um... Ooh, there's another door. Another door with secrets. Oh, no, this just takes us back. Is this where we started? This is where we started. Yes, okay. So... After all of that, we are back where we started, which is great. Um, you can move diagonally. That's that's a that's a cool thing. All right. Well, lacking a pet and being very concerned for the state of said pet, 
Uh, let's go downstairs. So these are these are the the stairs that you can descend to the lower dungeon level, and there's the upper dungeon level, which is where you eventually escape. I think if you if you escape, if you go up from dungeon level one, then it's like, hey, you you did you're done with the game. You got to dungeon level one, so that's the thing. All right, let's go down. I descend the stairs. There's a staircase here, and I see a statue of a gecko. What? Who would make a statue of a gecko? Geico? I don't know. Okay. Ooh. Oh, no. That's okay. Let's go this... What? I heard a... Th ah. Wait. Oh, oh, wait. I can see... Yes, message history. I hear someone cursing shoplifters. Who? Okay. Are we at Target? Do we find the Target dungeon? Ooh, it says I'm hungry in the bottom. Let's eat something. What do I want to eat? Uh, question mark. A, a, a lichen corpse. Uh, okay. It tastes it. Well, it's a lichen corpse. What are you? What am I expecting? All right. Poor, poor planning. Um, ooh, with great effort, I move the boulder. I hear the chime of a cash register. That indeed I do. I think I'm definitely thinking target. I try to move this one in vain. All right. So, no, none shall pass. Okay. So there's a boulder there. It's blocking my way. Let's try this. Ooh, another boulder? Really? What is? Okay. Oh, but I can diagonally get around it. Huzzah! Whoa! <laughs> Messages. What? Oh, so it's just... Yeah, it's... It, okay, we're definitely in Target. It's just gonna continue to interrupt me with information about cash registers. Um, is this really a debt? Let's search. Search, 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 search. Okay, it's a dead end. That's not, <laughs> that's not helpful. All right, let's go up then. And for a target, this is a very poorly... Ooh! Oh my gosh, look! Look, 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 it's my pet! I was looking for you! Where Where did you... What was your deal? I see a stout spear. Let's pick up the stout spear. Can I equip the stout spear? Uh, it doesn't say it's a plus. I, I have a blessed quarters. I'm gonna stick with the blessed one. Bless. Okay, let's go. More gold, hooray! We are totally winning this game already, guys. All right, um, and gals, we are we are winning. All right, we don't win anymore. Let's make 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 net hack great again. All right, okay, let's go up, up, around. The door opens and there's a thing. Let's attack the thing. I miss the jackal and the jackal bites. All right, I'm not good at this. I miss the jack. I kill the jackal. Hooray for me! Oh, I'm hungry again. Eat. I don't have anything. Oh no. Can I eat the jackal corpse? Aha, I can. It tastes terrible. Well, yes, but... And it's a statue. Why are these statues of... Ooh, a warhammer. Okay, sure. Let's, let's, let's carry a warhammer. And let's go down. Go down. Wait, I wonder, like, are these... Are these statues, like, like, uh... Some wizard, like, transformed these things into... Uh, okay, it's locked. Let's kick it. Kick in that direction. Wham! It's still locked. Wham! Ha! Ah, it crashes open. No, is this like a witch transformed these things? Is this like a... Like it got transformed to stone sort of thing? Ooh! A goblin! A goblin! I hit the goblin. I killed the goblin. I, I eat the goblin. I'm a bad person. An iron skull cap. Sure, let's grab that. Whatever that is. Six gold pieces. A lamp. I love lamp. <laughs> um, can I turn it on? Is there like a turn on? I don't know how to turn on dead. Okay, that's not what I meant. Um, if I hit question mark, it'll show me. Okay, so I can say list of game commands. So here, here are all the commands I can do. There's the number pad stuff for going around. How, what is display? Do, do, do. Kick, teleport, apply. Maybe apply. Maybe that's the right eat something, open the door, pay my bill. That seems, that seems particularly useful. Um, we accessory shoot or something. We could do, uh, blah, blah, blah. All right, um, yeah, see, way too many commands. This is a slightly over-designed game. All right, um, let's try apply. What do I want to use to apply? Oh, a brass wand. Oh, well, sure. Oh, no, I don't want to break it. I don't want to break it. No. Okay, fine. We won't do that. Here are me just trying to be, use, you know, use electricity and just make things difficult. Ooh, is that, that's a lichen, isn't it? I killed the lichen. Hooray. 
I swap places with the kitten. Why? How is? How did the kitten just manage to disappear last time? That doesn't make any sense. Actually, hang on a second. It disappeared, but then it ended up down in this level, and I don't think they go up and down stairs on their own. So I'm wondering. Ooh, I found a hidden door. Huzzah! It resists. Ah, uh, ha! Kicking in all of the things. Of course. Yeah. Okay. There's nothing in here though, which makes it less exciting. Ooh, another. Ooh. Ooh, hello, cheers, Kevin. Welcome to Man Lobby's General Store. That is a terrible name for a general store, Man Lobby. Alrighty. What is this? Ooh, a chainmail for a hundred Zork mids. Can I use chain? Because, like, in D&D, in &D, like, wizards have to wear light. Man, I'm the kitten is away. Okay. No, don't attack Man Lobby. Maybe, ooh, maybe I should. No, don't attack Man Lobby. Oh, uh, oh, Man Lobby's moving around as well because he's also a person. Why are you doing... A chain mail. There's, ooh, a, pl a plaid spell book. It's gone to plaid. Okay. A broadsword. Can I... Ooh, a scroll labeled read me. Sure. Let me take that. For you, there are only 27 Zorgmids for this scroll labeled read me. Hooray. Okay. The kitten picks up the plaid spell book. Good job, kitten. Yes, you can sneak that spell book out. An unlabeled scroll. And a scroll of enchant arm. Ooh, I would love to enchant the arm, but I don't have a lot of money, though. All right, fine. No, don't attack. Uh, what was... Wait, there was a command to actually pay. What is the command to pay? Um, pay. Oh, it's just P. Okay, well, can we actually... Can we sneak out, though? Oh, he totally... He's blocking the... Oh, that jerk. He's blocking the door so I can't get out. Yes, we'll pay for the scroll label to read me. Thank you for shopping, shopping in Man Lobby's general store. All right. Yes, you really need to work on it. All right. Better, better branding next time, dude. All right. Um, yeah, so if I hit five and then the direction, I will walk as far as I can in that direction. So that's just saving me some keystrokes. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Let's, what about the scroll? Let's, let's use this. The scroll label reading. Can we, what's the, how do we read the scroll? Uh, commands. Scroll, something, something, scroll. Can I just apply the scroll? Uh, oh, read a scroll or accessor? Okay, read. Read the scroll labeled read me. As you read the scroll, it disappeared. This is an identify scroll. What would I like to identify? Ooh, okay, cool. I can identify things. Uh, what is the red gem? Oh, I... Can I select multiple? Oh, I can. Sure. And yeah, let's select all of them then. A dwarvish spear. Uh, what? Oh, it totally didn't select multiple, did it? Whoops. No oh, inventory. Um. Duh. Whoa. Inventory. No, nope, it totally didn't describe all of them. Well, that's that's frustrating. Yeah, it's still just a red gem. It doesn't know what kind of gem does or how the gem gems things all right where's the that there's got to be a downstairs where isn't that word hmm where are all the where are we supposed to go now i don't know wait oh a lichen a lichen oh oh look at that i'm experienced level three. Oh my gosh that's amazing wait oh, oh so that's not experience points that's experience levels okay oh a fortune cookie uh let's take those can i read the fortune cookie Read the for <sighs> scrolls and spells. No, fine, You're not gonna let me do that. Then I don't want to play anymore. All right, I'm beginning to feel hungry. Well, fine, let's eat the fortune cookie. It's delicious and it has a scrap of paper inside. Okay, there we go. Thank you, game. You have redeemed yourself. They say that if you don't wear glasses, why bother with carrots? What is oh, because carrots. Because there was that whole thing about rabbits having good eyesight because they read a lot with the glasses. Okay. Ooh, there's an underscore. A rogue underscore. What? What? What, is, what does the underscore mean? An iron chair or altar. A neutral altar. So it's neither good nor evil. More info. Altars are of three types. In temples, they are for sacrifices. The stone top will have grooves for blood in the hole. Okay. Uh, that's a little terrifying. I th yeah, so we entered in the lower left, didn't we? So this is actually, oops. So this is actually the downstairs. Now, one thing that I have discovered is that if you try and go downstairs while your pet is not right next to you, they will not follow you. 
I'm I'm still hungry. Jeez. I need a lichen corpse. Okay, there we go. So now let's go downstairs into dungeon level three. But of course, we will have to continue dungeon level three in a final final episode. Yes, we're gonna win. We're gonna complete the series in two episodes in a, in a future episode. So I will hope to see you at some point when we do that. Cheers.